I'm telling you, man, I'll make good things change. I'm gonna make a ton of money, and I'm gonna have everything that I want. How many things cost? Oh, like a thousand bucks. Now you're in business, kid. What, are you some kind of loan shark? I'm a businessman. You want in? Yeah, I want it. If I had the money, there's no limit to what I can do. You I'll see do what it. I'm talking about? I mean, he's brilliant. <laughs> The checks from the Northridge account haven't cleared yet. If I write a check from that account into the second account, I can cover my shortage. It's called check cutting. It's illegal. It doesn't matter. Look, everybody thinks I'm some kind of hotshot now. I gotta keep that going. This is called restoration work. The insurance company's contracted out to restore it, and you make millions. We need to find a way to fake some non-existent restoration jobs. We're talking about hundreds of thousands of dollars in jobs that don't exist. We split profit, 50-50. Can I trust him? Absolutely. Your stock is worth $100 million. <laughs> I had everything I ever wanted until it all came crashing down. No, 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 no. Can I come see you? Who? The FBI. Special Agent Gamble, FBI. He can't climb out of this one, man. You have no idea what it takes to build something. You don't have anything because you don't have God. I'll buy God. You are hereby ordered to serve a term of 25 years in jail. The church has $5 million parked in a money market. Perfect ingredient for the successful Ponzi scheme. For once in your life, don't take a shortcut. You're running the scam. You really trying to change your life? Or is it just another Barry Minko comp? That's the case, get on the floor! You're asking me to give the carpet guy this bank statement for $5 million. What am I, crazy?